Facebook world. Just getting everything set up. Nashville, Tennessee. I'm excited to be playing for you guys tonight. I'm just gonna make sure it's shared to my other page as well. I'm just starting. What's going on? No, I'm good. Thank you. All right. Got a good roommate checking in on me. Okay. How we doing out there? Hi, Tony. Just gonna share this to my music page as well. Hope you guys are doing well out there, keeping our heads on straight with this whole quarantine. Hi, Dad. We'll get started in just a few minutes, folks. Live from my bedroom in Nashville, Tennessee. Share it in the Facebook page as well. Hi, Mrs. Hoffman. Steve, how we doing? couple minutes but can you hear me okay out there everybody hi Sam <laughs> at any point you can leave some requests to down below in the uh, in the comments here tonight and I will 
respond accordingly. As we uh, welcome everybody into the little live stream show tonight, I think I'm gonna kick this evening off with a little John Prine. It's uh, such a sad thing that we lost such a crazy, wonderful songwriting hero um, this week, and uh, his songs will live on forever, and that's the darn truth, which is so cool. So uh, I'm gonna start off with one of my favorite John Prine songs. Welcome to the live stream, everybody. You and me sitting in the back of my memory like a honeybee sitting around the sweet chalet. The hills on, the windows roll up, and my mind's rolled down. The headlights shining like a silver moon on the ground. And we made love every way love can be made. We made time. Feel like time can never fade Friday night, we both made the guitar home And Saturday made Sunday feel like it would never come It's gonna be a long Monday Sitting on my run down my river that has no ends It's gonna be a long Monday Stuck like the tick of a clock that's come around again. Tick of a clock that's come around again. That one goes right up to heaven to John Prine. Hope he's having a cigar that's nine miles long, vodka and ginger ale. Gotta love it. Can you guys hear me out there? Everything sounding okay? My mom says maybe not. Hi, Danielle. Danielle, good to see you here. Mari, hello. Aunt Barb. This is so cool. Hey, Timmy, how we doing? Sound coming through okay? Great. So nice of you guys to come. Thank you for being here with me tonight. It's a strange thing not to hear you. I wish that I could, you know, hear all your delightful heckling and such. Hi, Jackie. Pepper and I are talking about how much we miss Apollo. I don't have a 
have a Tennessee accent. You think that's happened? Has that happened to me thus far? Goodness gracious. Okay, thanks Sam, I appreciate that. Man, the live show is kind of a nerve-wracking thing. Um, but I hope you guys are all doing so well out there. This is such a crazy time to be a human. And uh, yeah, hope you're all keeping your heads on straight. Um, as interactive as possible tonight. Um, I'm really coming to you right from my bedroom here in Nashville, Tennessee. And I know you guys are all probably home too. This is a, we've all got a lot in common right now with this whole quarantine thing. And uh, so I hope you're finding great ways to, uh, to pass the time. Um, I wanna give a big shout out to the Janesville Performing Arts Center for having me tonight. Um, Back in October of last year, I got to play one of the coolest gigs um, I've ever played, which was opening up for Kobe Calais at their beautiful theater in Janesville, Wisconsin. And uh, I was just so thrilled. I definitely looked up to Kobe Calais as a kid, so when I got that email, I remember like saying it out loud and then responding as quickly as possible that I would love to be there. And um, and getting to actually play the show was one of the coolest, coolest things. I got to play in this beautiful theater. And um, so the Janesville Performing Arts Center reached out to me recently. It's a hard time for artists, obviously. It's a hard time for everybody. Hi, Anne. Good to see you there. Um, but it's, uh, it's a good time that we can all help each other out, too. So um, the funds from tonight's show are going to go to the Janesville Performing Arts Center and to myself as well for just making up for the gig income that isn't coming in. Um, so yeah, I'm so happy that you guys are here. Thank you for sharing with me. Um, shoot me some notes along the way. And uh, I've got a list of requests that I've gotten the last couple days for the show, so I'll be playing those songs and a couple new ones as well. So here we go, let's do it. Hi John. I'm going to start off with a request uh, from my friend Monica. This is one of my favorite songs to play, and uh, if you've seen me play a show, I'm sure you've heard, heard it before. This one's called The Restless and the Reckless. Thank you guys for being here with me. Let's kick it out. Between the restless and the reckless And I 
there's no reason why we should shy away from the light that makes us come alive. That makes us come alive. Oh. And we're single. Oh, 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 oh. We've got to let go. Oh, oh, oh. And we're single. Between the restless and the reckless, and I try to make sense of the mess where there's no reason why we should shy away from the light that makes us come alive. Makes us come alive. Thank you guys so, so much. Um, how are we doing out there? Is everyone doing okay? I was, I was singing that song and I was thinking about how it is a little bit, a little bit restless for sure. Um, I am singing at, my, singing at my house, Polly, uh, due to the coronavirus. I'm sure a lot of you are staying put right now and uh, it's a little bit of a scary time for sure, but it's also such a beautiful time that we all have a lot of in common and a lot of time to slow down. And uh, so if you're okay with that, I'm going to kick it off with some, some new ones that I've written. The, uh, for most of my quarantine, I've been out on a family friend's farm. And uh, it's just been a couple of us kind of hiding away from the world. And uh, thank you, Tina. Good to see you. Oh, I got a request for Jeffrey Jones early. You know it's gonna happen. You know it's gonna happen for sure. Um, great to see you, Jim and Tina, here too. I'm gonna get so distracted, I'm so sorry. I'm gonna try and keep telling stories as well. Um, but been out on a family friend's farm for the past three weeks and uh, you know, the it's it's been a kind of a collective deep breath for all of us, you know? We're kind of not allowed to hustle and bustle like we're so used to doing, so. Um, there definitely has been uh, some peace that's come with slowing down. So I'm going to play you a little song. Um, this is a new one. It's called Sitting Still. So Let me know what you think of it. Well, I've been taking morning slowly. Waking up with the sweet sound of the birds Reading books and sipping coffee I forgot how much I love getting lost in words Well, it took us a while to get here It took the world falling apart But maybe we needed to take a step back to remember how lucky we are well, It's not time It's falling asleep In the afternoon Sunlight that's keeping us warm Against our will We're finally sitting still And savoring the days before they're gone I wonder took us so long, so long. We spend our evenings telling stories and playing games like we're all kids again. We're sitting on a front porch laughing, it's God. Against our will, we're finally sitting still 
I know this uh, quarantine, this slowdown is kind of a, an up and down journey, I'd say. There's highs and lows to it, but I've really been trying to lean into the taking this beautiful downtime and using it to write and read and make music. Thank you guys for being here, for all the comments, heck yeah. Um, I am going to keep rolling with some of the requests I've gotten this week from some friends. Uh, one of them from my friend Tom is... Uh, a newer song of mine, I haven't released it yet, but uh, I wrote this one, um, it came from a story about my neighbors, um, actually. So I grew up in Cary, Illinois, and uh, so the flatlands of Illinois, and my neighbors there had been the Taylors for most of my life. And recently they moved out to Colorado, I saw we had a couple Colorado friends on here too, hi Lauren. Um, and recently they moved out to Conifer, Colorado. Colorado, which is tucked up in the mountains, and uh, I went to visit them when I was on tour there, and I was so um, amazed with the uh, the view and their little tucked hideaway home. I was like, I looked at Mr. Taylor, and I was like, How long have you been trying to get here to this beautiful mountain home? And he looked at me and he said, Claire, I've been trying to get here since I was 18 years old. And I said, Okay, well, Mr. Taylor, it took you long enough. And he said, yeah, you know, after I graduated high school, my dad made sure I could get one job. And so I went in for one interview just to make sure I could get a job before I ran off to be a ski bum. And he said that after he went in for the interview, the person who interviewed him was his future wife, Mrs. Taylor. So he said he stayed behind for those pretty blue eyes. And I said, okay, Mr. Taylor, I guess love is a pretty good detour. And he said, and that's the name of your next country hit. So I wrote this song for the Taylors. This one's called Detour. Well, I had it all figured out Knew which road I would go down Thought I could do it all on my own But then you came
Now it's called the tour. Thank you guys so much for being here with me tonight. This is so fun to see y'all. Uh, I did just deny that I had a country accent and then I said the word y'all, so that's my own fault. Um, but anyway. All right, um, next on the list I had a couple requests for um, the title track of my latest EP, which is called uh, Don't Quit Your Daydream, which is the life motto, um, no matter what. Um, and uh, so this one goes out to uh, Jen and to Karen as well. Good, good, good. <laughs> Thank you, Mar. Alright, this next one's Don't Quit Your Daydream. Hey, David, how you doing? Oh, sending lots of love to Aaron, too. And all you guys over there. My Milwaukee crew. Good, good, good. I'm happy you guys are here. Mm -mm -mm. Let me know if there's anything you want to hear, Dave, okay? Um, Don't Quit Your Daydream. Let's do that one right here, right now. Are we ready? Are you ready? Am I ready? That's the real question. Wow, I am awkward on this thing. that t-shirt happy you're here thanks for coming on heck yeah and hi Valerie thanks for listening to so good to see you guys heck yeah are we all doing okay with the quarantine and everything out there it is a pretty wild time to be alive and I uh, hope you're all keeping your heads on straight and uh, getting into some fun hobbies and uh, pulling out the arts and crafts kits if that's your thing or building gardens in your backyard um, 
I've been playing a lot of solitaire, that is the truth. I've gotten really good at solitaire. That's what I've been mainly doing in, uh, <laughs> in my off hours here. Oh, I don't live in Janesville, no, but I live in, I'm, I'm based in Nashville here, but um, I've got some Wisconsin roots. I went to school in Milwaukee, and my folks live there now, actually. Um, so I play in the Wisconsin area a lot, which is why I'm so happy to have the Janesville Performing Arts Center um, as a partner for this event tonight. Of course, Karen, thank you. I had another request for uh, an older one that I'm going to try and play for my friend Anne over there. Um, this is a song that I wrote a long time ago about being over-caffeinated, so if you can relate, please enjoy. For the request. Heck yeah. And heck yeah, I think the world does need a little bit of optimism right now. So I'm glad you're here. We are gonna be as bright as possible tonight, you know? Heck yeah. <laughs> okay, what's up next? I wish that I could hear you guys, that would be the best ever, but um, I'm so happy that you're here with me anyhow. 
And uh, I did just want to give another shout out to the Janesville Performing Arts Center. I am so happy to be partnering with them tonight. Crazy time. I know a lot of my artist friends and music friends were all having gigs and tours canceled, which is kind of scary for the financial end of things. And, you know, a beautiful theater like the Janesville Performing Arts Center, they aren't being able to put um, on events where they make all their money too. So if you want to support music tonight, I've got a virtual tip jar happening. Um, and my Venmo and my PayPal are listed there. So any donations are so, so, so wonderfully appreciated. So thank you guys. But thank you just for listening and being here. I've missed just like playing for people. So let's keep this party going. Do you guys want to hear another new one? I think I'm going to try another new one for you. Um, so I've been reading a lot. And uh, I found a copy of um, Fahrenheit 451. I'd never read that book before. It was kind of a, one of those apocalyptic kind of books as well, so it was weird to read at this time, for sure. Um, I somehow missed that one in high school, so I wanted to catch up on it. And uh, I got to the end of the book and was looking at other books by Ray Bradbury, and he wrote a book called Dandelion Wine, and I haven't read that book but I really love that title. So this is a little song called Dandelion Wine. Let me know what you think of this one, friends. I'm watching suns. <coughs> oh, hang on. <coughs> I'm ready for ya. I had something in my throat that wasn't the coronavirus or anything. <laughs> Watching the sunset on Tennessee hills. I wish I could capture it, I never will. I'm not a painter, can't stand the lines. I'm just sitting here sipping on a dandelion wine. It's starting to rain, but I don't feel a thing. Sitting now rocking on that old porch swing. I found me something that tastes like springtime Just sitting here sipping on dandelion wine And all my life I've known So You can make plans, but they change on a dime. So pour me one more glass of dandelion wine. Oh, 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 oh. oh, oh, oh. change most of the time I'm just sitting here sipping on dandelion wine I'll just be sitting here sipping on dandelion wine that's the latest thank you Good to see you, Anne Eileen. Hi, Meg. Oh, Meg had a request tonight, too. Um, this is a little song that if you've seen me laugh, I think you've heard me play before. Um, 
It's a song I wrote with my dear friend Neve Canan. She's a lovely gal um, that I lived with my first year living in Nashville. And uh, we wrote this song as a warning. It's called Be Careful You Kiss in Nashville. Are you ready for me? Let's do it. Thank you, Sam. I'm glad you like the new one. Oh, good, you guys. I'm happy to hear it. Mm -hmm. I will say I've never had dandelion wine, but it sounds delicious, and I'd like to try for sure. Okay. <laughs> okay, if you know this one, sing with me from home, all right? Years ago, when I moved to the south, thought I was in for a treat. Sunny days and steel guitars and all the southern gentlemen that I met. Well, I smiled when the first one took me dancing. I was charmed when he opened up the door. And right, that's worse Cause you'll end up in a verse Of some country song They're trying to sell It's happened to all of us down here <laughs> I was on my way To a show with the girls a friend of a friend Was playing in town To my surprise I Oh, I recognize another singer in the round. It was a gentleman who taught me how to line dance at the bar, singing a song about a girl he taught to line dance nights before. I thought to myself he had in time to make a call, but he sure had time to put it all into a song. So be careful. Loosely based on a true story. Ain't that the truth? <laughs> Heck yeah. <laughs> yep, sweet Nashville, Tennessee. Gotta be careful when you hang out with a bunch of musicians all the time. Um, what are we doing next? More from our quest line. Let's do it. Are you guys having fun out there? You with me? Oh, good. I'm so happy to hear it. Uh, well, my mom requested one that I, uh, an older one that I wrote with my dear friend um, and great songwriter Jim Callahan. Uh, I haven't played it in a while, but I'm going to try it out for you. And uh, it's, it's really a song about... Uh, being there for for your friends and your neighbors and I think there's a time in life where we especially need to be there for each other and I hope it's a it's a good reminder to be kind to everybody around us and uh, you know no matter what your differences are what your opinions on different things are um, this one's called winds of change Oh, 
my mom. Thanks for listening. Sometimes your heart feels so heavy when you're far away from home. Wait a When you're traveling on your own That raging river can be frightening When you're crossing it alone If you need a friend to count on I've got a shoulder I can love Sometimes you walk through the darkness when you're looking for the light. And sometimes the truth can deceive you when you're trying to get things right. The raging river can be frightening when you're crossing it. If you need someone to count on, I've got a hand that you can hold. I'll be right here. And we can talk about our hopes and fears. One thing is clear you can hear it whispering in the trees. Change of blowing in the breeze, they're blowing in the breeze. I'll be right here. Something like that. Thanks for writing that one with me, Jim. Oh, I'm glad you guys like it. <laughs> good, good, good. Alrighty, I've gotten, if you'd like to take a little bit of a 180 in terms of mood, I've gotten a couple requests for a song that I wrote about, uh, I hear this cat. Um, a hairless cat by the name of Jeffrey. It was a hairless cat that I ran into unexpectedly um, in an Airbnb in Berlin. And uh, I was not a fan of this hairless cat. Okay, I've got some hearts. People want to hear the cat song. I get it. You better be singing this one with me at home. I always make you sing it with me in public. <laughs> Um, but I will sing it for you. Um, at one point, I did try and sing this cat away from me. Because um, desperate times call for desperate measures. This is my song about a hairless cat. Jeffrey Jones. Alright, let's do it. Jeffrey, Jeffrey Jones. Jeffrey, Jeffrey Jones. Oh, I can see all of your bones and I don't like it. Jeffrey, Jeffrey Jones. Jeffrey, Jeffrey Jones. Oh, I can see all of your bones and I don't like it. Every time you walk in the room, 
I try to get further from you Your severe lack of whiskers Well, it makes me shiver The winters must be hard on you Jeffrey, Jeffrey Jones Jeffrey, Jeffrey Jones oh, I can see all of your bones And I don't like it Lions and tigers and bears I'm adding cats with no hair From this list of fears that I've had all these years You can call me a coward, that's fair Jeffrey, Jeffrey Jones Jeffrey, Jeffrey Jones oh, I can see all of your bones and I don't like it Sing it with me, Facebook Live, are you ready? Jeffrey, Jeffrey Jones Jeffrey, Jeffrey Jones oh, I can see all of your bones and I don't like it <laughs> It's my song about hairless cats <laughs> Dear goodness We'll work on t-shirts for this summer If not t-shirts, koozies perhaps if anybody knows any uh, any artists out there who like to draw hairless cats or specialize in that, you send them my way. I'm looking. <laughs> oh man, oh man, oh man. What a time. Also, I should put out the footage someday of me interacting with the hairless cat. At one point, it tried to get into my guitar case that was laying on the ground and I about lost my mind. And my good friend Jory Struff got some good footage of that. Oh yeah. Oh, I think I'll uh, play you my Celtic song that I wrote about that European tour as well. Um, the most beautiful place in the world that I've been is this small, beautiful town um, tucked away in the highlands of Scotland called Dorney. And uh, our, our sweet tour guide there, Breed, she had referred to the rugged highlands in this little beautiful town untouched by chaos and madness and just untouched by so many things. She called it the land that time forgot and I really loved that. So I wrote most of this standing at the foot of this beautiful Aileen Donan castle with my friend Jory and uh, Every time I sing it, it takes me back there, so I hope it takes you somewhere, too.
you guys so much. It means the world that you guys are here with me right now. Man, an hour goes by so fast on here. Um, please comment and let me know if you'd like to do something like this again. We've just got about 10 more minutes in the concert here. And um, I want to give another shout out to the uh, James Noble Forming Arts Center for asking to partner with this on me. Um, and then there's a lot of live stream stuff going on, so I'm happy that you guys took some time out of your evening to come hang out with us here. Um, please consult the virtual tip jar if you'd like to make a donation to My Music Career and the Jamesville Performing Arts Center um, at a crazy time like this. And I'm also doing something um, in my free time. Obviously, uh, we all have a lot of it right now, but I'm making a lot of handwritten lyric sheets. So if you have a favorite song of mine, like that one, and you'd like to have a copy of the lyrics, and you're making a donation of some kind tonight, um, just let me know which one you'd like and I'll send you a copy. You know, it's a good time for doodling. I've always been a doodler, that's for darn sure. Gotta love the handwritten stuff. That's always my favorite stuff when I like go to a music museum of any sorts. So I'm always wanting to see the the first draft of lyrics as it was written in somebody's notebook, so. Fun stuff. Okay, I just got a couple more for ya. It's been lovely to spend some time with you too. Um, okay, I think we're gonna do two more songs. That sound good? But what should they be? Oh, I've got a couple, I got a couple requests for a song I wrote with my friend. Um, Evan Klein, this one is called Congratulations. you guys. Heck yeah. 
Cool. If there's interest, I'll totally do another live stream like this again. It's a lot of fun to be singing for some people, so thank you guys for being here. Um, this last song is for you specifically. I usually do it for my, uh, my intro song, um, but it's my outro tonight, so uh, this one goes out to you and everybody listening. Hope you guys stay sane out there, keep your heads on straight, um, and stay positive. That's all we can do. We live in a world where the coronavirus exists So it's pretty cool that you came on here tonight Instead of watching Netflix I know there are many ways that you could spend your time I've been getting really good at playing solitaire with mine And thank you to the J-Pack for inviting me to play their virtual venue Cause I really miss being out there Playing shows and it's nice to spend the night with all of you Thank you guys so much for being here. Heck yeah, I'm glad you guys all came. Oh, you know what? I've been messing around with some new covers. I think we've got time for one more, if you're down. There's a song that I just love so much. I tried it out last night, um, but let's try it for you again. One more and then I say goodnight. <laughs>
thank you guys so much. And just remember, shoot me a, a Facebook message or leave a note here if you donated tonight um, to the virtual tip jar and you'd like a handwritten lyric sheet, just send me a note what song you'd like and I'd love to send one your way. Hope you all stay wonderful and stay healthy and stay positive out there. Thank you for your support and for believing in me. Have a great night.